nothing can stop me. I'm all the way up. Oh. Guys, what is going on? It's Jacob here. Today, I just want to share with you guys just one product, one of my all-time favorite products when I'm dieting, even when I'm not dieting. You know, it's uh, it's fantastic tasting. The macros are unbelievable, and the uses are not just as a yogurt. And in saying that, this is the product I'm talking about, which is Jibani yogurt. Now. Shibrani is a Greek yogurt. Um, I have never ever found a Greek yogurt that has as high a protein as this does and as low a fat as this does. Um, it comes out in sweetened versions with flavoring in there, like strawberry, raspberry, things like that. It comes out in a 0.5% fat version, which I don't particularly like because it's not creamy enough for my, my liking. But this one is a 2% fat version. It's really, really creamy. It's absolutely fantastic um, it takes like tastes like Greek yogurt so you know if you want to sweeten it you're gonna to have to put something in there but if it's an artificial sweetener with no calories um, you're getting a really really nice tasting yogurt with macros of 129 calories per serve 17 protein 3 fat and 7 carb so you know that is absolutely fantastic like I said before you can use it for different things I love to use this as a sour cream, believe it or not. So, you know, you've got your nachos. Nachos, unless you use a really nice, lean, high-protein meat, are going to be, you know, relatively high in fat, high in carbs, and low in protein. If you want to up the protein, you know, take the sour cream out of it, fuck that off, up the protein, and it still tastes exactly like sour cream, even, even better, to be honest, in my opinion, have some Jibani 2% yogurt. Um, that is my tip for you for today. Chibani, 2% as your sour cream. If not, you know, sweeten it with something low in calories and you've got a really nice tasting yogurt, um, nice and creamy. Try the 0.5% fat option. You know, that's even less calories, even higher in protein, but, you know, it, it is a little bit more runny. It's not as thick. So this is the ultimate product. Try it out. I'm sure you'll be able to add it into things. You know, you can add it into your baking, put it in your oats, on your cereal. You know, you can make freaking high protein, you know, frozen yogurt. You can make high protein ice cream with it. Put it in smoothies. So, you know, I'd recommend you try it. If not, if I haven't swayed you already, tell me what products do you guys use, man? I'm a flexible dieter. 100% flexible dieter. I'm open to anything. Give me some tips, man. I'm always... I'm always looking for more tips, then I can put out more videos for you guys to see. So until next time guys, have a great day, I'll see you in the next one, peace.